That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. What the heck? Discovery's four computers now have primary control of critical vehicle functions. Okay. You got speed, John Glenn. What's up viewers, this is the Master Spore 3 and today we're going to be looking at the Star Miner mod by, I don't really know actually, um, some, um, it's Japanese, so everything had to be Japanese, I had to translate it. Oh, let's get it! Yep, that. So, let's get on to it. It's actually an amazing mod. No, this is not one of the randomly generated structures. I built this. It's actually pretty cool. You can take a look at it later. So. We are, uh, we're going to our secret star base on Earth, and we got all these crazy things here. Hi uh, there. These are our workers, and they just won't shut up. Who is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there it is. So used to 1.7 style stuff. Oh, that's better. So, what this model has you to do is to go into space. In fact, it actually makes it far, far easier compared to the Galactic Craft mod, which I could not figure out. So, um, enough to chat and let's get on with it. So, um, here are your things that allow you to, you know, do stuff. And then, um, we'll get to that stuff later. So, let's get out of here. So, um, first I'm gonna show you the gravity wall. And what the gravity wall does is it allows you to walk on walls and ceilings. To do that, or make one you need. Three of these things, we'll get to those in a sec. You know what? We're gonna craft. Uh, we're gonna craft them anyway. So, discovery. To craft Your goal for this, you shut down on time. Four glass, four obsidian, and a block of iron. It's actually fairly expensive. And you're gonna need a lot of them for crafting recipes in this mod. And then this one uses lava, three dirt, um, sandstone, outer core. Man, this is gonna get expensive. So, anyway, what this allows you to do is walk on walls. Let me show you. I'm on the seal. I'm on the wall. Uh, oh, I designed this very badly, so I'm, I'm gonna go outside. Ooh, this is perfect. So I'll ju I'm just gonna go attach these to the wall. Where's there a good wall to attach these to? Oh, here's one, right uh, here. So we'll just cover this up. Why? These grass. Ah, oh, there we go. No. Come on! There we go. So, so I'll show you what these do, guys. This allows you to walk on walls. Not awesome. Look at this. I'm on the wall. <laughs> Look at me. Oh yeah. Okay, no more. So, whoop. Whoa! <laughs> that is the ultimate source or form of transportation. Okay, no more messing around here. We got a planet to explore. It's up there. And um, we need a special way to get to it. To get to it, we may need one of these cannons that are scattered throughout the thing. And these are called man bazookas. Let me demonstrate. Uh, where are they? Oh, they're in this tab right here. To make a man bazooka, you will need... Uh, there are two different crafting recipes. You can either use um, gunpowder or inner star core. Other than that, you will need cobblestone walls, wood, cobblestone, and a furnace. It's odd. But, oh well. Odd stuff, odd stuff, odd Three, stuff. So, two, one, okay, so, zero, so we'll just walk ourselves. And it puts us on a squid. Sky does Minecraft would absolutely loathe this for obvious reasons. You know? Yeah? Okay. So, I think we should get on top of the roof and launch ourselves to the new planet we, we discovered and built our base by. Well, it, okay. Get up there. Woohoo! Uh, come on! It's impossible! Discovery Houston, uh, we're still looking at it. I do have a solution. So, let's see. Let's build ourselves a little. Oh, cool, it's a light source. So. Do ourselves up here. Here we go. Ah. All right. I'll get back to you in a sec. All right. This seems promising. Let's go. Woo! 
It worked! So, um, we're on the bottom of our planet that we discovered. And, um, turns out these actually spawn throughout the world. Uh, in quantities. So, we got these cool things. Uh, I put those there. And, um, only, for some reason, only players will be affected by the new, uh, by this new gravity. For example, if I try to push a villager, I will flip. He will not. What? It's not working, see? It's, it's still, uh, the mod's still in alpha, so, um, don't blame anybody. So, there I go, that's how a plant is. So, um, how does this work exactly? Let's get to the center of this. So, on the inside, there are tons and tons of awesome ores. Enough that you could dream of. And then we have this stuff, and we have a plant. So, yeah, that's, I'll show you how to use that in a second. So right now, we need to learn how to make our own planet, of course. That's right, we're gonna learn how to make planets. But first, we need to learn how exactly to, um, you know, get around the planet. These are planet things necessary, and we got these things that we're gonna need. This thing basically reverses the gravity. It doesn't look like it's doing anything. I think it only does that on planets. So, let's go on to a planet or a star, but it doesn't matter. You could call it either one. So, boom! It'd be nice if it could just flip me up to down. But, okay, no more of that crazy stuff. So, we've got to do that. So, yeah, let's make our own planet. Oh, and the block. It also added a new thing called Star Dirt, but that's not absolutely necessary. We'll just make a stone planet, of course. Maybe a few um, star dirt here and there. So, yeah. I'll get started in a sec. Well, we got our star core right here. To craft that, we need all of this crazy stuff. So, after we do that, we take our inner star core. Our inner star core, of course. Like that. And then we get the top part and just make a little cube out of it. A Rubik's Cube, to be honest. That's all one color, so it's, no matter what you do with it, it's already solved. Now we do the outer core. I, I'm sure you can make it a slight bit bigger like you saw on the other planet. But we're just going to stick with this. Look at that! This is apparently how you make ground objects in Minecraft. This is really nice. I like that idea. Uh, but, you know, it makes it a bit round. So, almost done. We need to get the bottom part next. And done. That's part of the planet. And now let's actually um, turn this planet into a planet. So we'll have this on the one side. Like that. Like that. A few moments later. I'll be back with you once I actually finish this up. One week later. Done. It really doesn't look like the roundest planet in the world, but it works. So now that we've done that, let's get to the center of the, uh, of the Earth and modify it. So what this crazy stuff is, is um, stuff. So let's see, we can change the star radius and a gravity radius. So how, uh, how large, it, let's see, uh, how, where is the surface of the planet? And where and what's the top of the atmosphere in which the gravity is affecting you? So to do that, let's add five to this and five to this. Maybe add six. Okay, let's see how this works. And there we go, it works. That is awesome. Now let's, wow, this is awesome. Definitely, it works great. Why is it keep flipping me? Oh, oh, and I missed a few spots there. 75 years late, Tao. So let's increase the, uh, the uh, gravitational radius. And that, that should be better. And kaboom! Oh, okay, now we've got that uh, all sorted out. 
let's, um, I, I'm, I, you probably don't want to open up your planet just so you could get to the center of it and, and uh, modify the gravity. There's a special tool for that. And then, uh, and we need to get right straight to it. So we head back over to the building over here. Look at that. And we'll, we'll just grab these stuff for later. Uh, I need this. And then, uh, solar wind fan. We, we already have it. Derp. This is how we do it. Click on. Click on. Oh, we already we use it. All we need to do is right click it. That's easy. I don't even know what the heck this is for. Oh. Oh, you set the shape of it and it's going all wild. <laughs> So you could do like square planets, so you could make every kind of planet, even no defined Super Mario Galaxy! Okay, no more of that. And we pretty much covered all of the main features except for one measly little bit thing. And that's the foliage. You can plant trees upside down. It's gonna be wild. Let's let's do it. Let's definitely do it. Oh, and before we do such, just want to show you this is now possible. All right, so let's grow these plants. Oh, let's grow the tree. See, we have a tree now. And we'll grow uh, a spruce like that. There. And that's not all, kids. We need. And we have um, these plants. We have these plants. We even have a bed. A bed. Yeah, bed. So let's see. If we can actually plant these. Too bad, uh, too bad we can't plant it. Uh, plant it on the rock. And then we have a potato. And this potato will do stuff. You plant it, of course. And um, normally you're supposed to use a hoe for this. This is weird. But it's alpha, like I say. So, we have to sit down. Why don't we sleep like a bat? And just to demonstrate that this works, we'll set the time to night. Good night, everybody. <laughs> This is cool! We're upside down, and then we wake up, we're upside down again. Still. Yeah, this is probably one of the coolest mods ever. But that's not the whole- I'm <laughs> like, I'm orbiting the planet, that's cool. It's also pretty nice. I said the gravity way too high! Well, too much gravity now. So, that's not all that the mod has to offer. There's actually a whole other dimension that has been added. We're gonna need some cannons. Special cannons. Cannons! Powered by squids. We'll keep this secret, okay? No one tell us. Our planet looks beautiful. Alright, anyways, let's get ourselves up here. And, yeah, this is, this is gonna take a while. Hold on. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting, and they had to hire a new one. So we have made it to the maximum build height in Minecraft. 251 I'm on top of that. Now we're gonna just, just plop that down and um, go into the next dimension, because the next dimension is gonna be cool. We have to go up, I think, a, a, some number above 300. We can't build up there. That's probably why these cannons are here. Let's fly! We didn't make it. <laughs> but we may have to fly up there. Hmm. Oops, that didn't go as expected. Can't even place these. So what do we do? So I'm thinking we can use the... Uh... Oh yeah, we need a solar fan as well. To craft this, you will need four lapis, one stick, and that crazy stuff again. This to just fly off and make stuff a bit easier. All right. I wanna go faster, faster. And we're uh, no longer on the planet of Minecraft. We are in another dimension. What happened? This happened. Okay. Let me explain what's happening. Oh, here we go. So, um, I was on... So, um... I, I think, um, if you have... I bet you can't tell, but I'm not able to move. I can't even move at all. 
That's because there is zero gravity. And, uh, how am I able to breathe, and breathe up here? Let me demonstrate. I'm, I'm still breathing in outer space. That's just, it's like Star Wars, and people are somehow able to do that. So, um, it looks like the solar panel allows you to maneuver through space. Very neat concept. Now, um, apparently, I, I don't know if these are supposed to be stars. Oh, and there's also planets here as well. Whoa, that is cool! That's huge! Funk. So yeah, um, looks like this mod does have some cool things to offer. Could make for a good mod pack if you could get the permission. Whoa. Whoa, it's like, I went into space, it's... I mean, it was difficult, but a lot, a lot easier than Galactic Craft, because Galactic Craft is near impossible. And I'm saying it's near impossible, because I suck at it, and um, it requires to build stuff like rockets. This, you could just build up to the maximum build height, and then use the gravity re re reversal thingy. And there we go. This is, this is the best mod ever. Probably one of my all-time favorites. This mod is probably one of my all-time favorites. It's, it's it's just amazing. You can fly through space and land on planets. Whoa! Um, let's head back home before. Let's just head back home real quick. How are we falling? It's awkward. That's just, this is not right. Case. Still an alpha. Don't have to worry about it. And hopefully we'll be able to hit the surface again. Okay. Oh, and there's this navigator thingy. Craft it like that, but um, I don't really know what it does. So, it's turning red. It must be heading back. This is interesting. Alright. We're heading back home, guys! Woo! Coming back home to all the beautiful sheep and stuff. And I wonder if you could find the moon. Hmm. Bunk! Yeah, you could uh, probably take some fall damage. Wheel stop! Roger, wheel stop, Discovery. Welcome back. A great ending to the new beginning. Oh well. If you have an opinion, leave a comment. If you like the video, leave a like. And if you really like it, favorite it. And if you want more, subscribe. And I will see you again. This is mod link is in the description. I have nothing else to say about it other than awesomeness. Right. Made it! Wait, how do they make this for how do they make this obstacle course for kids? What is wrong with the engineers? This is dangerous! Alright. Made it to you, son. Wait, oh yes, finally we started.